Hi, traders, I have an amazing news for you. Well, with Next, what we have managed to do is create, make use of TradingView's Pine Screener facility. And we have created some amazing, easy to use scanners, which will definitely help anyone end of the day quickly run down those scanners and figure out which can be the high probability trades for tomorrow. Come, let's take a look. So let me take you to my screen. As you can see over here, I have the Next Plus Bull Scanner 1.0, and I also have the Next Scanner Bear Scanner 1.0. Now, thanks to our community members that we could be able to create such wonderful, easy to use scanners. I'm going to show you how TradingView has made it easier for traders like us to easily scan the markets and figure out high probability setups. First things is the Next Plus Bear and Bull Scanners are for the Next Plus community members. And uh, once I share these indicators and scanners with you, whenever you open your chart, this is my next uh, template. When you go to Trading Views Indicators section, and when you click on it, down here you will find invite only section all right and in that in this invite only section you will see that i have shared the bull and bear scanner with you and over here i will repeat that this is only for the next plus community members all right so make sure you favorite it it's important all right and then your next job will be once you have access to these scanners your next job will be to open a new template with the Pine Screener. This you can open from down here, the Crypto Pair Screener, and it will take you to this Pine Screener page. If you cannot figure out, you can go to Google and just type Trading View Pine Screener. It will give you a link. It will open up. Two things that you have to do. That is select your watch list and choose your indicator, in this case, the scanner. So let's say I drop down the watch list and down here, I select the next FNO universe. You can see the next FNO universe. And right next to that, I will drop down here and all the indicators that I have clicked favorite, I've starred them. I scroll down and you know I don't know for what good reason, it's not in a alphabetical order, maybe in an order that I have favorite them. But doesn't matter. You come here and you see next bull and bear scanner. So let's go with the bull scanner first. And there you go. The bull scanner gets loaded and everything that we have managed to code within the bull scanner opens up. Which means that if you are a next plus community trader, you know what's an HAGB. You know what is a positive decoy. You should know that what's a dual inside bar, a first crush and a positive and a negative, not negative, this is bullish scan. What is a positive classic divergence and a hidden divergence? So let's say, um, let me just scan one for you. Let's say I want to figure out which are the stocks which have created a Heikanashi inside bar. So I drop down here, I say true. You see this place gets highlighted and up over here, I'll just hit scan. The moment I hit scan, it's going to take a few seconds. Within the FNO universe, it will scan for HAGB and it will give me the list. Okay, one more thing. If I bring my cursor close to this um, indicator next plus bull scanner, over here you can see one day. I'm going to quickly click on there. You can see that trading view will allow us intervals in which we can use our, uh, our logic from one minute to as high as one month. So I can, by default, it's one day, but I can change it to one week or one minute. That's up to you. There's one more thing. Of course, if you're listening to me on this video and you are a Next Plus community member, then you know that our entire analysis, our entire system of price analysis, setup building, everything focuses on Heikanashi candles. And so by default for the bull scanner, the HA close is selected. HA close is selected, right? And uh, you may not be that, you know, interested in Heikanashi. So in that case, what you can do, you can go to settings 
and if you deselect it if you remove it then this entire calculation will happen not with Haikanashi but with actual candle close I will click on Haikanashi and apply it and I'll run just one more in front of you that is I want to come out of Haikanashi HAGB and I want to find contractions stocks which have contracted so I come to ADR contraction I quickly hit scan and these are all the stocks which are contracted Achha, can I find stocks which are contracted as well as creating an inside bar I come to true now it will scan both of these let me scan and there you go all these names come out from from 230 odd stocks you're getting 17 names which you have to check I can take it one level further I can say okay let's see dual inside bars let's scan it further only two stocks which means that these two stocks today are really really contracted means a very small candle a high breakout candidate of course in this video I'm not going to talk to you about uh, the thunder setup or the TIMF or these are all proprietary uh, setups that we have created within the next plus community and doesn't make sense to talk about this in this particular generic video but you'll know about positive divergence wouldn't you just click on it and there you go today as I'm recording this for you there are no positive divergences on the daily time frame let me check if there's any hidden divergence no I didn't get it so this was a positive bullish side you want to go to the bearish side you just come to the indicator you remove it go to the indicator again scroll down click on the bear scanner and you can do the same thing all over again from a negative point of view now from a negative or a bullish point of view the high canashi the inside bar the dual inside bar and ADR contraction they are neither bullish nor bearish they are non-directional they are contractions but apart from that there's neg negative decoy and all the rest of the negative uh, rationale the negative logic so if I select on negative classical divergence within the FNO universe and I hit uh, look for the scan these stocks are making a negative divergence HCL Tech, HDFC Life, Infosys and I can quickly open up any chart and I can open them and check that is my scanner doing the right thing and I see yes the prices have gone up the RSI has not it's a negative divergence so there you go guys this was the next plus um, scanners this is the this is the version 2 we had created one version but we have taken it to a next level and hopefully as trading view evolves and improves we too in our future will add better tools like this which will make the life of a trader easier to find out opportunities do let me know how do you find about this scanner if you have found something more useful also share that with me thank you goodbye and trade well